I can't get rolled. So I get through Hell Week, and this is where the shit gets fucking evil, man. This is where I start to click into something. When you, when your mind, this is this this, this whole forty percent rule shit I talk about all the time mm -hmm. that I made up a long time ago. I started making it up through pain. Tell them what that is. Where you go? So basically, the forty percent rule is, I am a strong believer that we quit. Because why? How the fuck does a two hundred ninety-seven pound cockroach guy right. who quit on everything is now considered the one of the baddest men on the planet. Mm -hmm. How is that possible? Mm -hmm. It means I had to change one thing, my mindset. Mm -hmm. So there's no way in hell that that was in me, but that was. That guy was in me. Mm -hmm. One that guy came down here and said, hey. Guess what, man? You're a fat ass. But I'm gonna now make you a badass. <laughs> I want a miracle this shit to be a badass. No, mm -hmm. it was in me. I had to believe and make that belief work. And through hard work, I did that. So the 40% rule is like we have a, like a car. Some cars have a governor on it. And when you get to like 92 miles an hour, that car will start doing this because it can't go any faster. Those cars that don't have governors on like a, like a fast ass, whatever, Porsche, whatever, I'm a fucking bury it, gone. We have that ability in us, but we have put this governor on our minds. And you have to, the factory that put the governor on that car, the factory is now you that put this shit in your fucking mind. You gotta take that motherfucker off. Until you take it off, you're gonna constantly get to 92 miles an hour and do this. Cause you ain't gonna go no faster. As a matter of fact, you might even go slower. So basically, I started realizing this through my life, through going through all these times. Discipline, it, it, it does start with waking up early it really does but that is just the beginning and i always say that discipline is the root of all good qualities but you have to absolutely apply it to things outside of just waking up early it's it's everything it's working out every day making yourself stronger and faster and more flexible healthier discipline is eating the right foods to fuel your system it's about disciplining your emotions so you can make good decisions it's about having the discipline to control your ego so your ego doesn't get out of hand and control you It's about treating people the way you would want to be treated and, and doing the tasks that you don't necessarily want to do but that you know will help you or help your team. It's about facing your fears. It takes discipline to face your fears so you can conquer them. what discipline is. Discipline means taking the hard road, the uphill road, to do what's right for yourself and for other people. It's so often the easy path, the easy path that calls to us to be weak for that moment, to break down for that moment, to give in to the desire and the short-term gratification. But the discipline will not allow that. The discipline calls for strength and fortitude and will. It won't accept weakness. It won't tolerate another breakdown. The discipline can see like it's your worst enemy. But the reality is, discipline is your best friend. It will take care of you like nothing else can. It will put you on that path. The path to strength and health and intelligence and happiness. The most important It'll put you on that path.
to freedom.